Well, greetings, fellow dwarfers. Welcome to Red Dwarf Nerd. Today, I'm giving you my picks for my top one-liners from each season of Red Dwarf. By no means is this an exhaustive list, and there are hundreds of other amazing moments. But these are a few of my favourite lines, which hold up well without needing a big visual gag to back them up. So while moments like this are absolutely legendary, and no one smegging nuts. Well, that's good. <laughs> Without that visual of Rimmer's crazy attire, it wouldn't quite hit the mark. So we're sticking to one-liners that really stand up on their own without needing a big visual hit. Right, let's dive right in. Well, to kick us off with season one, it's got to be the king of deadpan himself, Norman Lovett, delivering a brilliant line, of course, as Holly. I am Holly, the ship's computer with an IQ of 6,000. The same IQ as 6,000 PE teachers. <laughs> for my pick for season two, we need to look no further than the first episode, Crichton, with the original Crichton played by David Ross. The Crichton in this episode is a little bit bewildered and has been serving three dead crew members for hundreds of years. They're all dead. My God. <laughs> well, I was only away two minutes. <laughs> For season three, I was spoilt for choice, which just made narrowing things down even harder. But my pick has to go to Marooned with a fantastic scene of Lister chowing down on some dog food after being stuck in Starbug for weeks on end with very little rations. Well, now I can see why dogs lick their testicles. <laughs> Take away the taste of the food. <laughs> Season 4 was another one well spoilt for choice, but my pick has to go to a classic scene between Crichton, now human, and Lister, with Crichton taking pictures of various parts of his anatomy to show Lister and get his opinion. An absolutely brilliant scene with some fantastic lines. I want to know, is that normal? What, taking photographs of it and showing it to your mates? <laughs> no, it's not. On to season five now with Lister facing off the low ship Rimmer. A classic scene with some outrageous costumes and brilliant lines delivered by the boys. I'm going to lash you to within an inch of your life. And then I'm going to have you. <laughs> For season six, I'm going to cheat the rules a bit here. This one really is falling into the realm of a visual gag, but you know what? It's so brilliant, I'm going to let it get away with it. Here we have the cat, robbed of his cool, robbed of his pizzazz, robbed of everything that makes him the cat. And what we end up with is just simply a name. <laughs> For season seven, we got the return of everyone's favorite alter ego, Ace Rimmer. In a fantastic opening scene that sees him battling Nazis on sky and on land. A fantastic scene which ends brilliantly with a German soldier looking up and delivering that classic line in German. That's for ein Kerl. <laughs> ah, the much maligned season 8. The return of the full crew to Red Dwarf does divide opinions a little bit, but there are some good lines in here. And one of my favourites has to be the very last line of the entire season, as Rimmer quite literally gives death a good kick in the balls. Remember, only the good die young. <laughs> That's never happened before. Whether you want to call this next season season nine or just the Back to Earth specials, I don't mind. But my pick for this one has to be Crichton's reaction after Rimmer commits hologramicide. Is that a word? She didn't see that coming, did she? I did. Season 10 was a fantastic return to a full six episode season. My pick here has to go to Rimmer's reaction, seeing Lister trying to get a vending machine back up off the floor that he'd knocked over. Rimsy, 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 oh yes, CCTV, sabbatical note, here we come. <laughs> My next pick from season 11 doesn't go to a member of the Red Dwarf crew, instead it goes to Professor Baldwin, giving a brilliantly smart answer to one of the local police. How dense do you think I am? You really want to know? Just divide your mass by your volume. <laughs> 
And for the last full season, season 12, my pick goes to episode 3 Time Wave, with Lister's brilliant reaction to seeing rubbish artwork on the walls of a ship. So everything these guys do, no matter how garbage, gets to go on the wall? Just like it's St. Trembles <laughs> in the Tate Modern. <laughs> Well, there you go, people. That was my pick for one-liners that work brilliantly without necessarily needing a big visual gag. I picked one from every season, and of course, I had to miss loads out where there were some seasons that were just so strong with loads and loads of great stuff in there. So if you think I've missed any that were even better, stick them in the comments below and let me know what you think are the top quotes from Red Dwarf. I really enjoyed putting this one together. It was great to go through every single season and pick some great bits out. I really enjoyed this one. I think we're going to be doing more top 10 type lists in the future. So if you've enjoyed what you've seen today, then make sure you hit subscribe so you know when the next video is out. And even better, hit the bell icon as well so you know exactly when the next video is out. Give us a like if you've enjoyed this one. Leave us a comment of anything you want to say, anything you want to ask, or any of those quotes that you've got in mind. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next one, Smegheads.